Hello, today we're going to look at a new feature that was recently added to Spectrum which allows us to quickly change the active projection. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to launch Spectrum and I'm going to create two projections and let's just use the defaults here. Set up one here, say Ghana Base and let's pick Ghana on the country list. Okay, I'm going to select OK. So now I've created one projection, and it's down here, and that's currently the active projection. Now I'm going to create an additional projection. Let's choose Ghana again. And this would be used for comparison purposes. And let's call this one Ghana Change. And I'll click OK here. So the active projection is the projection um, that is active when you move into the DEM project editors. So in this case, Ghana changes our active projection. And if I move into a particular editor, I am actually editing the Ghana change projection. If I wanted to edit the Ghana base projection, I would have to switch that by using the drop down over here. Now, the new feature that we added is, in addition to selecting the active projection here, I can simply move down here and select the file name, which allows us to rapidly change between two projections. So in this example, I'll make Ghana change the active projection. Then let's move in to the total fertility rate. And let's say we want to set that down to replacement level. And let me highlight that, do a quick interpolation, say OK. And let's take a look at the results. And as expected, our population is shrinking on the Ghana change projection. And if I switch back here to Ghana base, go back in, you'll notice that the TFR here has remained the same as the default values but the Ghana change projection has the values that we entered, which resulted in the change in the total population. Okay, so that's a new feature we added, and I just wanted to highlight that. Thank you.